In a world that is dominated by social media platforms, a question I get a lot from fellow artists and musicians is, do I actually need my own website? Now, we definitely need our own URL to run conversion ads to send people to Spotify and anywhere else, but do you actually need your own website? Well, my answer to that is, no, you don't actually have to have one, but it is really good to have one. A website allows you to build a hub of a platform to send people to so that they can find you elsewhere from there. It's kind of like a more professional version of a link in bio. And it looks really good. And it's a very helpful and useful tool to have both for yourself and for your audience. You can stick the single link in everything across the internet and send people there so that they can figure out where to go from there. It's kind of like a more robust landing page with more options. But when it comes to actually making a website, a lot of the options out there are very complicated and have a whole bunch of features that you don't really need as an artist. So today I'm gonna to walk you through a website that I have discovered called Card. I recently used Card to build my own website, which is basically a robust landing page that allows me to send people to my official site and they can pick their journey from there. I have links to all my social media, to Spotify, and to Shopify where I sell merch. So today we're gonna walk through Card and I'm gonna show you exactly what it looks like and how I set it up. Now this video is the first in a new series that I am starting out on the channel called Monthly Favorites. Monthly Favorites is gonna be a playlist of videos that I deliver one of every single month, a new one every month, where basically I'm just gonna share the things that I have discovered, that I have uh, started using or have been using for some time, and that I'm just excited about. Things that I find useful and that I wanna share with you guys that I think you'll find useful and helpful as well. So it could be anything from a website building platform like Card that we're digging into today to you know, merch websites. It can be a tool I'm using. It can be a, sp a specific piece of gear that I've got in my studio, a new plugin I've found, kind of anything across the board that I have discovered that I think is really cool and useful and I'm excited about, I wanna share with you guys. And I wanna put that all into one series, one playlist in one place. And so we're gonna call that Monthly Favorites. So this is the first video in the new Monthly Favorites series. And in this video, we're gonna be digging into card. Now, Card is a very simple and straightforward platform that basically allows you to build one-page websites for pretty much anything. In fact, their website says simple, free, fully responsive one-page sites for pretty much anything. <laughs> when I was looking around for a simple website builder, Card really spoke to me because it seemed like it had all the tools I needed and none of the extra fluff and frills that I currently needed to build my own website. So before we hop into Card, let me show you the website that I built for myself. This is my site, tomdupreethe3rd.com, link in the description of this video if you wanna check it out. And it's basically a glorified landing page. I've got an image of myself as an artist, I've got my logo, a brief title of what I do, music producer and YouTuber, and then a little short bio about what it is that I do, and then links to the places where I want you to go. YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Spotify, and then Shopify for merch. As an artist, as a musician, unless you are blogging, unless you are sharing a whole bunch of other different kind of long form content, if you're getting started with a website, you really don't need much more than this. As you go, you might find that you wanna have something more complicated, but if you are just starting out with a site and you've never had a site before, or you just want something easy that is easy to set up and is effective for your purposes, Card is the best thing I have found to do that. So jumping back over to Card's website, if we scroll down, they have it again, build one page sites for pretty much anything. And they've got all these really great templates that we'll dig into in a minute. And the cool part is to get started with this is absolutely free. If you want to just build a site without your own domain attached to it and have some basic features, the free version is great. But if you wanna do more than that, like say connect your own custom domain, which I hope you have if you're trying to run ads for yourself, then you're gonna to wanna to go for the pro version. And the cool thing about the pro version is it's pretty cheap in terms of websites. It's only 19 bucks a year and you can build up to 10 sites with that. You can connect up to 10 domains you can build 10 one-page sites for kind of anything you want to. So if you wanted to start your own agency and build one-page sites for other artists, you can do that with Card. <laughs> Not only can you connect your own domain if you pay a little bit of money, but you can also add stuff like forms and analytics and tracking. 
You can add your Facebook pixel to this. You can add checkouts for like PayPal, Stripe, Gumroad, and you can remove the made with card thing in the footer of the site, which is also really helpful. As you probably noticed on my website, there isn't any footer at all. There's no branding except for my own. And for me, that's important. So once you've picked through card and you decide that you want to use it, uh, the next thing is kind of picking your template. And the cool thing is they have all these really neat templates that are pretty simple to customize out of the box. In fact, that's what I used for my site. I just picked one of these templates and just tweaked it a little bit. And it took barely any work at all to get it to look how I wanted it to look. We can look through all these templates. They have a ton of different categories here. We'll go to all, but they just have all these really cool things that you can set up. You can structure it as kind of like a link in bio type of thing. If you want to, you can make it look a little more website-y kind of like mine does. And you can even get more complex with it and add like multiple sections and pages if you're into that. What I did is I went to the profile tab here and the one I started with was this one, John Smith. So if we go to the demo here, this is basically my website. I just switched out the things that I wanted to include in it. So I used this exact template and I just dropped in my logo, changed the uh, headline, changed the bio, changed the links and changed the image. And that was it. It took me virtually no time at all. If you go to the dashboard here, you can see that my website is up. It's live. It looks pretty much identical to the one here and it was really easy to set up. In fact, once you get into the dashboard here, you can just go to new site. And then again, I could go down here and select this, this template here, and then I can just start customizing it. So I can upload an image of myself, profile picture here. I'll just upload that and we'll just customize this really fast. So you can see how easy it is. It takes about two seconds to do this whole thing. There's going to be more things you're going to want to do, like adding in um, some stuff for your pixel, changing out your links and things like that. But if I just change the name here, there's my name. I can add that uh, producer done. And then I can change this. I make music and videos. Pretty much uh, I can have it done exactly how I want it to. So I'll just make this a little bit smaller because... I want to have it all in one line, so we'll do that. And then I can just change out the links and it's literally that simple. So if you wanna start making a website for yourself as an artist, first of all, I do recommend starting with something simple like this. Even if you don't choose card, I recommend starting with something simple, just like a simple one page landing page thing until you have other elements that you need to add on one page, a simple landing page will get the job done. You just need a hub, yourartistname.com. People can go there, find your links and have kind of a base for a home base, if you will, to find you and then go from there to discover you on other things. So this is a great way to up your brand. This is a great way to improve kind of your forward facing look for your audience, make yourself look more professional. And it's really easy to get set up. If you want to get started with card, I've got a link in the description of this video. Highly recommend it. This is my monthly favorite. This is the thing that I have been using that I love uh, right now. It was easy to set up. It got the job done. It's getting the job done and I highly recommend it. Now, before I sign off, if you don't subscribe to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and like and share this video if you're digging it. And at the end here, I've got a couple other videos you can check out. Uh, once the monthly favorite thing continues, we'll have more of that up here. But for now, Thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.